Welcome, welcome back, Spaceology audience, as we dig deeper into the Iron Throne, like the cats that want this throne that's behind me, right? What I'm sitting on now, and they're killing everybody and setting up all this intrigue. So that brings us to Septa Unella, who is one of a character who's, you know, comes in in season five, is gone by the end of season six, but has like a major impact on the story because of the things she does. Like I said, she rolls with the High Sparrow. She's like the enforcer for the High Sparrow and really comes in prominence when she snatches up Cersei Lannister. Now remember, Cersei Lannister is going to be judged. They've already got Loras Tyrell. They've already got Marjorie Tyrell. Now they got Cersei. And, you know, Septa Unella becomes like her tormentor every day. She comes and visits her. She's like, you know, I'm going to bring you some water, but I'm going to make force you to confess to get this water. Of course... Cersei can't do that, and so not only does Septa Unella not give her the water, she busts her in the head with the ladle. She's kind of just really, really tormenting her, and it gets really personal, because Cersei's like, look, you're not going to be torturing me, you know what's going to happen, I'm going to get you back, look at my face, this is going to be the last face you see before you die. But, you know, Septa Unella's got the upper hand right now, and so she like, she grinds it in, man, she gets serious about it. This is her following behind Cersei as she's making her walk of shame, right? She's behind her the whole way, yelling, shame, shame, just really just, 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 you know, egging it on, man, just making it worse. And look at her, look at her face. You can tell she's totally digging this stuff, man. She's really into her job, and you know what? But you have to realize who you're messing with, man. This is Cersei Lannister you're messing with, right? So after Cersei sets it off, blows up the, the Septet, and kills the High Sparrow and all the other people that were there, she wakes up to this, right? Cersei Lannister has got you strapped down to a table, and she's pouring wine in your face. So this is going to be bad. This is a bad situation. This is you. This is Cersei Lannister. Lord knows you're talking trash because she's about to do some vicious stuff to you. And you're like, what could Cersei Lannister do after I've been treating her so bad? Then she walks in with this guy, man, who's not even the mountain anymore. This is Gregor Clegane, who is now this monster. After he was killed by Ober Martell, who we talked about as well, uh, they put him back together and he's like the Frankenstein monster. So look at her face. She knows this is horrible. She take, He takes off his mask. This is a horrible situation. This is going to end very badly. Hopefully, mercifully, it'll be over. But this is what Cersei Lannister did to you. Strapped you down and sending this guy and you're going to be his plaything. And I, I don't even want to think about what he's going to do to you. And that's what you have to look at. And remember this face, Cersei Lannister. And what if she had her down? You totally had Cersei Lannister down, but, you know, like she always does. Yep. Last night she took the L. That's Cersei Lannister in a nutshell. You had her down, you were beating on her, but she wasn't out of the game. And look at you now, Septa Una. This is you now. Like, you're strapped to a table. You got Cersei Lannister just tormenting you. And that's got to be horrible. So, again, a really good character. Maybe you live through this. Maybe you get off that table. I think you're going to be changed forever after uh, Sir Gregor gets done doing what he's going to do to you. So, a great character. Check out us more as we continue digging into Game of Thrones. Next, we're going to get into talking about uh, some of the other assisting characters that play a big role in kind of moving the story forward. So check us out. Like and share. Check out our YouTube channel. Also, give us a like on Twitter. We'll be back.